Hi, I'm Stephanie Coombs, Managing Editor of the Edmonton Journal, and this is our weekly hit list. A local restaurant opening up just off White Avenue ran into a controversy this week over its sign. The restaurant, called Meat, was told the sign didn't fit with the heritage values of the neighborhood. This caused a pretty big co uh, controversy on our website. It was the most clicked on story all week. Meanwhile, reporter Jody Cinema checks in on people who have body piercings, but now figure maybe they shouldn't have done it. Some people have got those big holes in their ears that are all stretched out now. There's photos on this story you don't want to miss. Coming up this weekend, we have a big feature looking at Oil at 100 in Alberta. It was on May 14, 1914, that oil was first struck in Turner Valley, Alberta, and we take a look at what oil has meant for our province over the past century. Finally, coming up on Saturday, the Edmonton Rush, our local lacrosse team, heads into its first round of playoffs against the Calgary Roughnecks. If you're like me and admit you don't know too much about our other national sport, you have to check out this video by Journal Sports reporter Chris O'Leary, where he explains the game, why it's so fun, and the best part, it's cheaper than an Oilers game. For links to all these stories, look below or go to edmontonjournal.com slash the hit list.